using a smartphone and especially the P9, it was um, it was disarming and it was uh, it allowed me to take a more candid picture. I think it puts people at ease. First, we got the digital revolution where everyone moved to a digital sensor, and now everyone's moving to mobile. And I think that we're going to get lighter camera bags in the future, and we're not going to have to carry around as much to be able to get these great photojournalism and adventure photos. To give you an idea about the quality of P9 camera system, it's my great pleasure to welcome world-class photographers to this stage this afternoon. It's very important to have a camera that was very responsive into the low light yeah. conditions. Um, and also, it was very important for me to be able to control the camera in a very, uh, like, totally manual way, in the way that I would use uh, a traditional uh, professional camera. Mm -hmm. um, I've been a Leica photographer for a very long time, and uh, I was happy that the, the interface of the camera was very familiar, the sort of virtual buttons and even the, uh, the language that's used yeah. and the and the, the font it's all very familiar to a, to a Leica user and, and very easy to use for myself as a professional ski photographer I get to ski for something like a hundred days a year but I do that with this 30 or 40 pound camera bag all the time yeah. so for the p9 project I was really excited to get to try to go skiing and leave that entire camera bag at home and just carry around a cell phone and get to go create the images that I love to make with just that. For device like P9, I think it's another story for me. It allows me to uh, capture of and visualize the fleeting inspiration, which mm -hmm. is popping in my mind, mm -hmm. and also to capture even a crying face of a baby. Yeah. Yeah. So it gives me a lot of access to my personal yeah. normal life yeah. Yeah. and transit into a very interesting journey.